about the reasons. I understand that. Does it trouble you? Not really. What's important is that your mark is now stable, as is the breach. You've given us time, and Solas believes a second attempt might succeed, provided the mark has more power. The same level of power used to open the breach in the first place, that is not easy to come by. Clearly you have something in mind. We do. May I present Commander Cullen, leader of the Inquisition's forces. Such as they are. We lost many soldiers in the valley, and I fear many more before this is through. This is Lady Josephine Montelier, our ambassador and chief diplomat. Anderan Atishan. You speak Elven. You've just heard the entirety of it, I'm afraid. And of course, you know Sister Liliana. My position here involves a degree of... She is our spymaster. Yes, tactfully put, Cassandra. Pleased to meet you all. I mentioned that your mark needs more power to close the breach for good. Which means we must approach the rebel mages for help. And I still disagree. The Templars could serve just as well. We need power, Commander. Enough magic poured into that mark. Might destroy us all. Templars could suppress the breach, weaken it, so... Pure speculation. I was a Templar. I know what they're capable of. Unfortunately, neither group will even... The Chantry has denounced the Inquisition, and you specifically. That didn't take long. 
Shouldn't they be busy arguing over who's going to become divine? The remaining... It limits our options. Approaching the Majors or Templars for help is currently out of the question. Will the Chantry attack us? With what? They have only words. And yet, they may bury us. There is something you can do. She is not far, and knows those involved far better than I. Her assistance could be invaluable. I'll see what she has to say. You will find Mother Giselle tending to the wounded in the hinterlands near Redcliffe. Look for other opportunities. We in the mean. Have you kept in touch with our friends in Lady Esterly's estate? Several balls will play for her tomorrow night. We will have pain soon enough. of Andraste. I've heard this. You'd be Harding and I... No, <laughs> never mind. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should get to business. But Mother... J Mother Giselle should be somewhere nearby. <laughs> 